civilization has been overwhelmed by its many foes. But your people do not despair, for they know that one day you shall return and lead them forward to victory. Yes, we shall. I think for this one we should play as our uh, mortal enemies, the Japanese. Uh, map type. We should map type Earth to give us more room. Standard, yes. Difficulty level, yes. Game, yes. Alright. Let's uh, start our second civilization. Let's see if we can fare any better than uh, our last. Never know. Alrighty. This is really good ability right here. Units fight as though they were at full strength even when damaged. That that should be effective. Um Let's get our warriors to scout out the area, what type of resources. Thanks for the information. Um, it's gold. I mean, I guess it's as good a place as any to find a city. <coughs> um, I guess let's put out a monument because I don't know what we're going to do to start off. Mining, or not mining, archery. This could get us a good militaristic lead at the start. Keep sending our warriors out through the forests. So the way it looks, we're gonna definitely want to um, invest in upgrades for rough terrain and such. I actually like this uh, area we have over by us. A lot of deer and forest grassland. Elevated area. Once the mon monument is built, we definitely need to get scouts because these warriors don't get enough movement. Oh, well, is, is this coast or is this a. Uh, well, I mean, obviously it's coast, but is this a lake or. Three more turns until that monument. More gold. Some silver. Alright, mining is definitely our next focus. We 
be a groom, and let's def see, definitely get a scout. We have our monument as well. Checking our perimeters to see if there's any barbarians that we should be uh, worried about early on. We got archery, so we can get some early archers. What have we discovered? Thank you. What does this one do? Uh, we haven't discovered, discovered it yet. So, let's get mining. Should be good for our economy, possibly. should really be the scout's job to collect the runes and everything. Let's see what type of bonuses this will give us. Twenty culture. Not bad, not bad. We can adopt the policy. I think I want to go with our honor path we did last time. <coughs> Send our units back over this way. Finally, after this turn, we get our scouts. Once we get mining... Alright. It's definitely make a worker. It's going to take a little bit longer than I'd like. Send our scouts out the other way. See, they get much more movement than the warriors. These mountains seem like a good defendable position. After we get the worker, I'm definitely wanting to head towards uh, Archers. Oh no, the barbarians right there. Hmm. I hope they don't retreat. Because I've learned that going into enemy territory that they retreated into is never usually a good idea. With the Japanese ability to fight, like, they aren't hurt is really good. Alright, we found their encampment. Oh, this is something we gotta deal with because it's so close to our capital. Oh, now we're both even altitude. I see. That was actually a smart move. Hmm, that's an even fight. No unit needs orders. Next turn. Oh, crap. Oh, lucky us. Oh, crap, lucky them. That was actually a good move on their part. I don't have a great general. We don't want him to do anything yet. Research. Pottery. Now we're already set back in military. If anyone were to attack, we'd be screwed.
Citadels are really nice, though. We found that out last game. Some XP scouts defending your territory. <coughs> now, this worker is going to air. Oh no. Unless there's another barbarian encampment somewhere up there, we just got flanked. Our warriors should be out by then. That'll take them one turn to get to here to move down the hill. And I doubt they'll go straight. They went straight down. Alright. Weaken them by bombarding them from our city. I already got to pull a city defense, this is kind of bad. They're going to move this tile here. And who are these people? Greek. 